Egypt is a land full of mysteries, and no other civilization has sparked interest in both academics and the general public like this one. Its origins, religion, and gigantic structures like the towering sphinx and pyramids all remain shrouded in mystery, and people have spent decades unraveling the ever-evolving mysteries of this land. And even after all this time, there is still a lot that the mankind isn't remotely aware of. In fact, some of the greatest finds from antiquity are still buried in Egypt's dunes, waiting to be discovered. And the very thought of these additional mysteries and unresolved questions leads us to dig for answers. And that is what we'll look into today, some of the most mind-boggling Egyptian mysteries that remain unsolved to this day. But before we begin, make sure you hit the like and subscribe button so you don't miss out on such highly intriguing stories in the future. Now, let's dive right into them. Number 5. The Unnatural Hot Patches in the Scientific Images of the Pyramids This is something that has made all the scientists and researchers go haywire for finding a reasonable explanation. A few years ago, a temperature scan of the well-known tomb of Pharaoh Tutankhamun revealed temperature variances on the tomb to the north, revealing a secret opening below the wall's surface. According to University of Arizona Egyptologist Nicholas Reeve, Extremely high-resolution photos of King Tut's tomb show hidden passageways leading to undiscovered rooms in the final burial place of King Nefertiti, King Tut's father's bride. Additionally, three old pyramids on the Giza Plateau have greater temperatures that have been measured. Nobody knows what this signifies, not even researchers. Some limestone slabs are hotter than others for some strange reason. Now, you might think that this is because of the geographical placement of Africa, and it's a fair counter. Africa is undoubtedly a hot continent. But the intensity of these patches suggests that this is not due to the typical weather patterns, and there's a bigger reason to this happening. And in order to decode the same, experts still look high and low for secret rooms in the Egyptian pyramids that could possibly explain this but nothing of value has resulted yet. Number 4. The Lost Labyrinth This mystery got highlighted across the world after the discovery of ancient Greek historian Herodotus' description of a massive temple that is claimed to have 3,000 chambers filled with hieroglyphs and murals. He said, and we quote, This I have actually seen, a work beyond words. For if anyone put together the buildings of the Greeks and displayed of their labors, they would seem lesser in both effort and expense to this labyrinth. Even the pyramids are beyond words, and each was equal to many and mighty works of the Greeks. Yet the labyrinth surpasses even the pyramids. The Greeks named it Labyrinth in honor of the intricate network of passageways that Daedalus created for King Minos of Crete, including the legendary creature Minotaur's Lair. Numerous ancient authors claim to have seen it personally, yet 2,500 years later, we're still unsure of its whereabouts. The closest thing we found to it is a large stone platform 300 meters wide, which some people think was originally the labyrinth's base. The top story, if it is, has been utterly lost to time. A team of georadar experts surveyed the plateau in 2008 and discovered what seemed to be a subterranean labyrinth that resembles the one described by ancient scribes. It is since then known as the Lost Egyptian Labyrinth of Hawara. However, no one has ever dug it up or gone inside before. We won't know for sure whether we've discovered Egypt's greatest archaeological marvel until someone makes it into the maze. Number 3. Who built the pyramids and how were they used? Some people still wonder what race actually constructed the Egyptian pyramids. Black people lived in Europe before Eastern Europeans occupied it in the 19th century, according to a geographical analysis of Africa around the time the pyramids were built. Greeks, Romans, Turks, and French were some of these Europeans. The ancient Greeks made up the notion that slaves were the original builders of the Giza pyramids. Hollywood movies continue to spread the narrative, leading the majority of the world to believe the hype, according to mud brick tombs discovered in the rear of the Giza pyramids in 2010. A wall that was subsequently thought to be a tomb was discovered in 1990 by a visitor riding a horse. The signs were plain to see. During the pharaonic era, 
experienced craftsmen traveled from every region of Egypt to work on the pyramids. The option to be buried near the pharaohs was given to the laborers who passed away while doing the job. If they were just slaves, there is no way they would have been buried so close to Egypt's ruling class. But no one can till date convincingly argue what the actual truth was. Number 2. The Giza Pyramid's Missing Capstone The Great Pyramid of Giza arguably the most impressive and majestic edifice ever created by man, has been seen, researched, and investigated for millennia. Although many have played the age-guessing game and even attempted a scientific justification for its creation, nobody knows how ancient it is. However, the enigma still exists. It has long been believed that the Great Pyramid in Giza, Egypt, once had a top that is no longer present. This means that although the pyramid appears to be a perfect four-sided triangle, it is actually flat at the top and has at least 30 feet of flat walking space, according to those who have scaled the summit and measured it. The capstone, or the top, is said to be the component that gives the pyramid its true meaning, but nobody is certain whether there ever was one. Yes, some people contend that it never existed. However, if the capstone didn't exist, what was the precise reason for constructing the massive structure that required so much work and time, according to old knowledge and legends? This is where the conspiracies kick in. Some believe that the capstone was allegedly either composed of gold or covered in a coating of gold, and understandably, according to the Egyptian authorities, it was stolen from the pyramids with a number of other artifacts and valuables. But the contrarian side has a different viewpoint to this. They believe that the capstone activated a mechanism employed for a far higher and more significant purpose rather than a tomb. In an interesting initiative, the Egyptian authorities intended to crown the Great Pyramid at Giza with a gold capstone to mark the millennium. When the appointed time arrived, the relevant ministry abruptly and without warning canceled its plan. Why? Did someone caution them against using the world's oldest and most sophisticated machine? It is for you to think. Number 1. The Sphinx of Israel a 4,000-year-old Egyptian sphinx was discovered in 2013 in Tel Hazor, Israel surprising experts who had never anticipated finding one so far from Egypt. The remains of a sphinx that had been transported over from Egypt and had a hieroglyphic inscription between its front legs were found by researchers working with a team from the Institute of Archaeology. The name of the Egyptian monarch Misurinus, who ruled in the 3rd millennium BCE more than 4,000 years ago, appears on the inscription, and he was one of the kings that participated in the construction of the renowned Giza pyramids. But this finding blew the researchers' minds. Why? Because it's quite doubtful that the Egyptians inhabited Tel Hazor. It was a major commerce center in Canaan under the reign of Mycerinus, situated between Egypt and Babylon. So it's obvious that the place was extremely important to the financial health of two of the region's most powerful nations. The only explanation that seemed fit was the Sphinx would have been most likely a gift. However, if it was a gift, it's still unclear why King Mycerinus gave it or why anyone became enraged enough to break it. The only thing we can be sure of is that someone constructed a sphinx 1,000 kilometers distant from the Great Sphinx of Giza. The rest is for us to ponder upon. So these were few of the many mysteries that have emerged from Egyptian lands. And now we move to the most interesting part, the conspiracies. We're sure you must have some potential explanations for any of these five mysteries. Comment them down below and let the conspiracies flow, because that is where the fun lies in any mystery. Also, if you enjoyed this video, like, subscribe, visit our channel. There's a lot of amazing content for you there. We'll see you next time with another intriguing one. Signing off, yours mythically.